Sidney is a brilliant trumpet player in this universe. He's the inception of the musical movie star. Done. What do you think? I think you got those cameras pointed in the wrong direction. When sound comes in and he's offered a spot in this thing called Hollywood, he gets swept into it and we go along for the ride with him. This is right up Sidney's alley. It's like, all right, when do we start? With this new thing of sound cinema, he could show a whole new side of himself. Sidney Palmer is the coolest guy in the movie. He's the only one that never betrayed his art. He doesn't care about the fame. He just loves playing music. It's gonna be what it's gonna be. Madam, let's chat. Eleanor St. John is the mythic gossip columnist at the time. She is credited for making and breaking people's careers. You thought this town needed you, but it doesn't. Because it's bigger than you. Eleanor St. John is modeled on a variety of writers of this era, most specifically Eleanor Glenn. She's kind of a puppet master, pulling the strings of Hollywood. And when Eleanor sees Nellie up on that screen, she's like, that's what the people want. Eleanor takes her under her wing. Now, what did we discuss? When in doubt, say something French. If Eleanor doesn't like a movie, then that movie's not going to be successful. So she's powerful. You've been given a gift. You held the spotlight. And now, Miss Lady Faye Zhu. Lady Faye is a actress, singer, performer. She is this kind of larger than life, alluring star. Are you? I am. Lady Faye is the epitome of strength, grace, and elegance. Despite all the rejection that she's faced, being an American-born Chinese. Let's do a title here. Just call me the wild child. Faye's immediately intrigued by Nellie. Nellie is taken by surprise by Lady Faye's interest in her. There is something so intriguing and magnetic about Lady Faye. She's just a badass. I had a good run, didn't I? You sure did.